country where the echoes of ancient civilizations resonates through its mountains, where the aroma of spices and the sounds of bustling streets fill the air. This is Lebanon, a small country nestled between the Mediterranean Sea and the mountains. It has been a crossroad for civilizations across centuries. Its people have endured the rise and fall of empires, the devastations of war, and the challenges of the ever-changing modern world. Yet through it all, they have seemed to remain unbroken and unfazed. My name is I, Sophia Vanim. I'm in grade 10, and today I want to take you on a journey through the heart and soul of a nation that has withstood the tests of time. A nation whose people have shown unparalleled passion and resilience in the face of misery. And I want to talk about Lebanon, my home country, a country known not only for its rich history and vibrant culture, but also for the unwavering strength and resilience of its people. Lebanon's story is one of adaptability, from the disastrous civil war of 1975 that tore the country apart to the reoccurring conflicts that have plagued its borders. The Lebanese people have shown remarkable strength and courage. They have rebuilt their homes, their communities, and their lives from the ashes of destruction, time and time again. But resilience alone does not define the Lebanese spirit. It is their unwavering passion for life, for education, for culture, and for each other that truly sets them apart. It is the joyous laughter that fills the streets, the warmth of hospitality that greets strangers as friends, and the deep sense of pride and heritage that binds them together as one. Lebanon's cultural landscape is a vibrant tapestry, rich in diversity, from the majestic cedar forests that adorn its mountains to the bustling markets of Tripoli, from the ancient ruins of Baalbek to the cosmopolitan streets of Beirut. In the summer of 2018, I went on an unforgettable day-long road trip through Lebanon's diverse landscapes, where I encountered all four seasons in one single journey. I experienced the crowded streets in the cities to the tiny peaceful towns, tiny peaceful towns in the mountains. Lebanon is an example of a blend of traditions, languages, and religions. It stands as a coexisting place where the East and West meet, where modernity seamlessly intertwines with tradition. Lebanese people definitely don't shy away from their passion for their culture and their nation's heritage. Lebanon presents a rich paint, his, painting of history, art, music, and cuisine that reflects the diverse and vibrant society. From the ancient Phoenician ruins in Biblos that gave us one of the first widely used alphabets, to Feirouz, and her music that traveled across the Arab world into every single home. Lebanese people take immense pride in preserving and promoting their cultural legacy. They cherish their traditions and rituals, whether it's the vibrant celebrations of religious festivals or the lively gatherings with family and friends over a feast of meza and comfort food. This brings me to another thing that Lebanese people are very passionate about, cuisine. Lebanese cuisine embodies the essence of a country's passion for food and hospitality. Our hospitality is known across the world. Any Lebanese person would be willing to help or get to know a foreigner. The Lebanese saying, El Beit Beitak, or our house is your house, embodies Middle Eastern hospitality, inviting someone to come into their home as if it was their own. On the other hand, the cuisine is a reflection of the country's rich agricultural heritage and culinary traditions, whether it's the iconic hummus and tabbouleh or the mouth-watering shawarma and luchi. Lebanese cuisine is celebrated around the world for its flavors and diversity, with a Lebanese restaurant in almost every country. Furthermore, Lebanese people are passionate about education and knowledge. Despite the distractions caused by conflict and instability, education remains an important part of Lebanese society. Lebanese students excel in academic fields ranging from science and technology to literature and the arts. They value education not only as a means of personal advancement, but also for, as an opportunity for social progress and development. I now want to focus on the passion Lebanese people have for their community and their country. Despite the challenges that the country has faced these past few years, the Lebanese people remain deeply committed to building a better future for Lebanon. Nothing has been able to stop the Lebanese people from continuing their normal lives. An example of this is the Beirut port explosion that happened in 2020. This massive explosion led to mass destruction and displacement but ended up bringing together Lebanese people from various backgrounds in protests for justice to be served. However, even in the midst of this devastation and war, hotels and restaurants seem to be consistently fully booked. Concerts happen every weekend and the nightlife continues to thrive. 
The people laugh and joke about the situation the country has found itself in and act as if it's something completely normal. I said this in another project similar to this and it really resonated with me because it's true. The Lebanese people are really the happiest depressed people in the world. Now, Lebanese humor often takes the form of political satire, poking fun at the complexities and absurdities of the political and socio-economic situation of the country. This type of humor serves as a subtle form of resistance, allowing people to protest in a light-hearted manner. Uh, sorry. <laughs> uh, through jokes and satire, the Lebanese people reclaim a sense of power in situations where they may feel powerless. Additionally, the Lebanese culture places a strong emphasis on social connections and shared bonds. Even when the country is going through its worst, the people in Lebanon continue to gather with friends and family to share meals, engage in lively conversations, and celebrate various festivities. The act of coming together in a social setting serves as a form of emotional support, reminding individuals that they are not alone in facing the difficulties of the times. The vibrant nightlife in cities like Beirut is another form of this collective coping mechanism. Despite the economic challenges and uncertainties, Lebanese people continue to embrace the joy of life through music, dance, and socializing. Nightclubs, bars, and restaurants become spaces where individuals can momentarily detach from their words, creating a sense of unity and friendship. However, it is important to note that while these coping mechanisms offer temporary relief, they do not reduce the seriousness of the issues faced by the Lebanese people. Instead, they represent a form of resilience, a way for individuals to recharge their emotional well-being and find the strength to persist in the face of ongoing challenges. Despite everything the country has gone through, the Lebanese people remain unfazed in their determination to build a better future for themselves and for generations to come. They refuse to be defined by the tragedies of the past or the uncertainties of the present. In the words of the Lebanese poet Khalil Gibran, out of suffering have emerged the strongest souls. The most massive characters are seared with scars. Let the world be inspired by the passion and resilience of the Lebanese nation presents and the ability of the people to rise above the challenges presented to continue and aim for a country filled with hope, peace, and prosperity for all. Thank you.